microwave, I just want to give out some free prizes. I'm going to hand out a door prize slip. The first question on the door prize slip says, are you interested in having your own party? If you like what you saw here tonight and you can't buy everything, you have to be crazy not to have your own party. I come, I cook, I clean up, and you reap all the benefits. I actually do theme shows. We can do a death by chocolate party where I make chocolate martinis, a chocolate appetizer, a chocolate dessert. You can do a Mexican theme, mojitas, margaritas, and a Mexican appetizer. I'm actually now doing a five appetizers in 15 minute theme show. I don't let you put out anything. When your guests arrive, I have five delicious appetizers. But whatever you decide, we can do homemade sangria. I will come and pamper you, fill your kitchen with tons of stuff for free. And then Lori gets to go to your party and get a special gift too. Yay, everybody's happy. Okay, the next question on here talks about fundraising. If you are passionate about a cause, if you are active in a church, in a temple, if you have kids that play on a sports team, I do about three fundraisers a month. This is such a great fundraiser because you know if you fundraise with candles, not everyone likes them and eventually they burn out. So if you fundraise with Pampered Chef, the women are gonna have this in their kitchen for years to come. So I'd love to talk to you about partnering up and doing some fundraising. And the last question on here talks about earning opportunities with the Pampered Chef. If you ask me a question about the business opportunity, I'm gonna give you a yellow ticket. You're gonna write your name on the back. We're gonna pick for a second prize. Do not be shy. Ask me any question about the Pampered Chef. Who's going first? Who's I got a question? I have a question. I have the, um, the pitcher. Quick stir pitcher. Yeah, and it cracks. The handle cracks. I am going to give you a phone number. You're going to call them. They're great with returns. Okay. Who else has a question about the business? Sharon, how much money do you make? That's a good question. I knew you were going to ask that. Okay. So for a demonstration you just saw, and you, if you look at your watch, maybe I talk for 45 minutes, you're going to make anywhere from $100 to $300. That's a lot of money in 40 minutes. So you will make an incredible amount of money selling Pampered Chef. Who else has a question? Don't be shy. Question. How many days a month do you work? How many days a month do I work? Give that lady a ticket. Thank you. Okay, let me tell you, when I first started, my kids were little and I wanted to be a stay-at-home mom. So my friend was one of the first people on Long Island. She said, Sharon, if you do this two nights a week, you'll earn every incentive. And when my kids were little, I did it for a very long time, two nights a week. I'd leave my house at 6.30, I'd be home by 10, it was great. But then my husband lost his business a couple of years ago. And I went from doing it two nights a week to doing it five nights a week. But the nice thing about this is you can work as little or as much as you want. It's the only job that I know that fits into your life. You want to do it once a week, five nights a week, twice a month, every Tuesday, every Thursday. It's your business. You don't answer it to anyone. Great question. Who else has a question? Question. What are the places on your apron? <gasps> what about my apron? Good question. Not only do they pay I was just going to say, what are the perks? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I did. I was going to say, I'm going to give you a ticket for asking that, what are the perks? I said, what are the perks of being a <laughs> So not only do they pay you really well, but every year they reward Thanks, you with yes. a trip. If you do two shows a week, you will earn every incentive that they offer. In 19 years, I've earned vacations I never would have been able to afford. London, Paris, Greece, Alaska, Hawaii. The trips are always for two. Disney is always for four. And it's not the all-star Disney, it's the Grand Floridian. It's not Carnival, it's Royal Caribbean. But here's the thing. I just told you you could do this as little or as much as you want. What if you don't do it two nights a week? You know, you're not going to earn a vacation? And the reality is... I don't know what the statistics are, but most people in any direct sell industry have a full-time job already. Maybe you just want to do this a few times a month to supplement. Maybe your kids need braces, you want to send them to sleepaway camp, credit card debt. People need money for all different reasons. So the Pamper Chef knows not everyone does two shows a week, so every year they offer three levels of a trip. Last year it was San Diego, Cabo, or Ireland just for doing your job. You know in the real world, you do a good job, they give you more work. They do not give you a vacation. Before I sold Pampered Chef, honest to God, I worked for the largest law firm in the country. Every year they gave us a fruit cake. It wasn't even edible. We'd walk out of 919 3rd Avenue in the city, we'd all toss it in the garbage. I believe this company is the way it is because it was started by a woman. Is your husband up? It was started by a woman. <laughs> and a woman knows how to treat a woman. And Warren Buffett bought the Pampered Chef several years ago, like seven or eight years ago. And he left everything the way it is. So yeah, it's owned by Berkshire Hathaway. He owns Geico, Coca-Cola. So it's backed by an incredible corporation now. But it is just the best job in the world. Who else has a question? Question. Do you have a certain area 
So I have a certain area. No, you can work wherever you want to work. When my kids were little, I would stay in Suffolk County because I wanted to leave my house as late as possible and be home as early. Now my kids are old and grown and gone, and I don't want to look at my husband that many nights a week, so I'll go anywhere. I have friends that live in Brooklyn, New Jersey. I'll go over. I'll sleep over. Yeah, so you can go anywhere. There are no territories. Question. I'll come to Arizona to do a party. You betcha. Do men ever run To men. I want you to look in the catalogs. The number one selling salesperson is a man, David Meenan. He lives in New Jersey. Think about it. Would a woman book with a man or a woman, right? So he is like the top seller in the company because, yes, a man will do very well selling pampered chef. Good question. Could you do like a team? Absolutely. I have girls that start out, you know, with a friend or a mother and a daughter or a husband and wife. But you know what happens? When you start out with a friend, you go out, you make yourself 200 bucks for your demonstration. You're like, I don't want to share it with my friend. So eventually everybody breaks off into their own. But you absolutely can do with a friend, 100%. Anyone else have a question? Question. Is there a dessert cookbook? Yes. Oh, you know, we used to have one. Let me check and see if we have one. Thank you. Anyone else have a question? Question. Are there benefits? You can buy them through the Pampered Chef. I get them from my husband, but you, there is a way to get them through the company. Good question. Who else has a question? Do I train? Give that Jackie a ticket, please. Usually I have somebody with me. What happens when you're new and you sign on is I usually have somebody with me taking notes or videotaping me. But the great thing about this business is, and the way technology is today, everything is online. There are training courses for everything. How to sell stoneware, how to sell cookware, how to have high attendance at your party. So we have great online training, and I am here with you every step of the way. I always say you're in business for yourself, but never by yourself. I am with you every step of the way. When I first started... I went with my friend Jill six times. Now girls are like, Sharon, I came with you once. I have you on videotape. I got this. So yes. Question. So say you got someone, five people here that start their own business. <coughs> Good question. When you bring five people into the business, you become a director. What does that mean? It means you get an increase in your commission, and then you earn a, you earn a percentage off of everybody on your team. When I first started, I was so excited about how much money I was making. I became a director in four months. I now probably have about 300 people on my team, so I always say there are nights that I'm home that my girls are out working, and you know you make money off of your team. I probably make on my own, the shows that I own do, my own commission is probably about 4000 a month, and then I make another 6000 on my team. I make about $10,000 a month selling Pampered Chef. It's crazy. Every month when I get paid, my husband's like, I don't get it. I don't understand. This is incredible. It's the greatest job in the but world. But the more people that you have becoming a sim, it's like, isn't it like the less, it's pulling from... No. Let me tell you why. There are so many kitchens. It's not a pyramid. A pyramid would, would mean that if you're on my team, you'd have to give me some of your commission. That's not like that. The pam This is not like that. The Pamper Chef rewards me for being a leader in the company, and they give me extra in my pay, but it's not any of your commission. Your commission is your commission. And what I think you were asking before is, is it competitive because there are a lot? Right. No. There, honestly, on Long Island, there's maybe 100 and some odd people that sell this actively. Think about how many kitchens there are. In Nassau, Suffolk, in the five boroughs, there's no one in Manhattan that sells Pampered Chef. The entire borough of Manhattan doesn't have one Pampered Chef consultant. Queens and Brooklyn, a handful. So it is still considered a ground floor business opportunity because so few people sell this. Crazy. And here's the thing. You saw me do a live cooking show. You can be a Facebook consultant. I have girls on my team. If you're on Facebook, you might as well get make money while you're on Facebook. You get a free website when you buy one of those kits on the back of the catalog. And what happens is you set up events for your friends because not everyone wants to have a live party or maybe you don't want to do a live party. You set up an event for them. For 10 days, you post recipes and pictures. Where do you get them from? The Pamper Chat Facebook page. You copy and paste them in your pajamas at 11 o'clock at night on your couch or in your bed. And at the end of 10 days, you earn commission because they ordered off your website and your friends earn free products. I have girls that are catalog consultants. They don't do live shows. It's like the old Avon ladies. You give out catalogs to your friends that work in offices, schools, hospitals. They collect orders. They get free stuff, and you earn commission. I happen to do a little bit of everything, but you can do whatever works for you. Anyone else have a question? Tax. Well, I didn't get any. Oh, here's a ticket for that lady right there. <laughs> Tax? Tax. Good question. You get a 1099 at the end of the year, and you do. I will tell you that the accountant... 
the first few years, oh, well, for a while when I first started selling this, they deduct everything. Your phone bill, your food, your clothing, your car, everything gets deducted. Anyone else have a question? What about recognition? That's a good question. Oh, thank you okay. so much. That's you were just exactly going to ask that. Of course. <laughs> Let me tell you about recognition. I always say I'm married 27 years. When I clean my bathroom, nobody cares, no one notices, no one's ever said thank you to me in 27 years. This company, just for doing your job, doesn't know what to do for you. Every single month, the FedEx man comes to my house and I get more gifts. I have earned the iPad 3. Gift cards, gas gift cards, Visa gift cards, Michael Kors bags, jewelry, just for doing your job. It is crazy. Who else has a question? Are we good? I want to tell you this. Every month, there's a sign-on bonus. Every month, there's a sign-on bonus. This month, if you decide to sign on and try Pamper Chef, and here's the thing. I always say, give this 30 days. Don't look past one month. Do a couple of shows. Have your own show. Double dip. You're the consultant, you get the commission, and you're also the hostess and you get free products. Do a couple of shows in 30 days. At the end of a month, if you don't love this, the worst thing that will happen to you is you have a pocket full of money from the few shows that you did and more products you could possibly imagine. That's the worst thing that's going to happen to you. The best thing is you can find out, like me, that it's the greatest job in the world. If you sign on this month, they are giving you the $160 knife block set at the end of 30 days and a couple of cooking shows. So girls, I would love to help you get started. I am always looking for great people. There are so many kitchens in Nassau and Suffolk that have never had a Pampered Chef party. I would love to help you get started. Any other questions? Are we good? Question. Do you sign up to a website? Yes, you sign up on our website. You've got a little girl a ticket. That's a good question. I have another question. Another question. Go. Do you have to do an interview? Do your interviews with me. You're hired. Yeah. <laughs> Question. Returns. Do you handle the returns personally? They do not. They protect us as consultants. Otherwise, I would get to a party and people would have, you know, things they want to return. We have a great 800 number. You call and they are amazing with returns. They stand behind everything. Good question. Are we good? Allie has a question. Okay. Um, like the prize you said you get out of the month, at the end of the month, does it matter, like, how many shows you work? Yes. If you do two shows a month, you get rewarded with a gift from the Pampered Chef. It's always two shows a month. It's never hard. It's always easy. And I do want to leave you with one last thing, and I always say this. You know, as moms, if your kids came to you and said, Mom, I want to try soccer, I want to try baseball, you'd never be like, don't bother, you're not going to be good at it. You would encourage them to try it. But women are very hard on themselves. They always say, Sharon, I can never do what you do. Here's the truth. I never in a million years thought I could ever do this. My mom used to write a note for speech class because I used to throw up the night before at the thought of talking in front of people. My own mother was like, how are you going to stand up and talk? Are you good I'm like, Mom, I'm going to try it. I wore a turtleneck because I get covered in blotches when I get nervous. That's, that's you, right? I wrote everything out on index cards. I have a little ring on it, and I read my cards for the first month. And then after a couple of shows, I'm like, oh. I don't think I need the cards anymore. And I swear to you guys, if I could do this, anyone can do this. It's the greatest job in the world. We're good? Okay, we'll get the dessert. Thank you, Rachel.